there's another one there. Right next to it. There's another one. They dis they like they hide in plain sight. It's amazing. That's something on four legs with hoofs. We'll be back. I gotta cover some ground today. So what I hadn't gotten into yet was I could see a vision earlier about the bamboo forest, so I was putting it off because it is so cold and I was just going to wait for the sun tomorrow, but it's been like pressing, pressing, pressing. Look at this. There's the rest of it. I was just gonna say, I don't know, like, I don't know if there's more to it, but I could tell it's a gift. Look, there's the rest of it laid right in here. Isn't that wild? That side's a little ragged. That it's definitely it definitely got broke off the top clean right there. It almost looks like a cut how perfectly done it is. Wow. I'm sure there's somebody, right, who's like, oh, a person cut that and put it there. <sighs> Why would anybody in a lush, green bamboo forest all the way on the other side of this place cut down a dead one and then proceed to bring it all the way to the mouth of the trail either cut it which we know it was broken obviously but this is just for entertainment purposes obviously just do yourself like if you're one of those people that's doing that right now just Do yourself a little favor and just expand. Just a little bit. Five years ago, I was just a curious lad on the topic. Four years ago, I was a believer. Three years ago, something like that. Yeah, everything changed. This sun is rapidly. I'm just filming now, like we got all day. I have got to. Actually, we could go to. There's two bamboo forests now. We know this much, right? We could actually go to either one. I was gonna go to the one on the far side, but I guess we could just go to this one. I haven't really given that much thought. Damn. Okay. Oh, there's a huge fresh break over there. A big tree. I thought there was a deer standing there. Alright, you know what? We'll go go right over here I'm gonna probably <clears throat> if I decide to go to the other side I'm gonna have to make a second video probably 
but we'll go over here and see what it feels like. I'm super stoked about this, about this gift. I am super stoked. I haven't been excited about a gift in quite a while. <laughs> to me, it feels similar to like the antler, you know what I mean? Like I'm so stoked about it. You believe this? Look at how pronounced this trail is all of a sudden. Look, this wasn't here last time. Not like this, not this laid out. Look, look how traveled this is. It's laid down. It's laid across. I'm gonna duck under. It's gonna get dark in a hurry. Wow, it looks a little more open in here. I don't know. If, maybe we're just down, down a little further. I'm gonna open up the view. Yeah, like why would somebody skip over this huge thick? I mean, this is such a nice, beautiful piece. It's already been snapped. <laughs> See? You could probably actually find brown and green ones just laying on the ground. Yeah, look, here's a fresh one. That one's barely grown right here. It's a ground X. Here's the teepee right here. The bamboo teepee, look at that. A burnt piece of wood. More burnt wood, more burnt wood. This is broken off, look at that. This looks like it's laid upside down, almost like it wanted water to uh, roll away. Like roll, collect and come down maybe. to say if that's his primary purpose something went on here too in this little section here look at the way those vines twist around in a circle hello my friends thank you for guiding me back here we all really like this place thank you for your kindness to make of it. At least we can. So, I have a theory, right? Oh no, the burnt wood. And I think that it happens when uh, something big stepped here. I think it happens uh, when they use portals. When they come and go, it kind of, it, it can kind of like singe or like wow let's look at this mud right here excuse me my friends look at this here what is that I can't tell if the it almost looks like feet were there like like those are heels like something was standing there like this Aiming downward. Like standing on the mound looking outward. But outward where? I don't know. Something's knocking. I 
something, Brian. It's, it's something like it's ectoplasm is the word I'm looking for. For the stuff that like comes out and burns. Like, look at this. See that one snap down there? This one goes and crosses it. But it bends. It goes on a huge high arc and then there's one that crosses out from over there. All the way over there. And that bends up and tucks under it. There's no way that thing snapped from here and then magically went up and tucked itself under something that came from all the way back there. Sorry, it's just not, it's not something that happens. Look at it, it comes, it actually comes all the way. It actually comes all the way down. It's not just held down by that, that's just to hold it down. It comes all the way down to this little section in here. Almost to the base of this tree and these vines. Connectivity. There's a bamboo. Look at this. There's one upside down. This is upside down in this tree. Upside down. This is the top of it. Oh, it's getting dark, I know. But this is the top of it. It's a young one. There's actually more upside down that I didn't realize. Another one. There's one going up into it, into those two upside down. There's one going straight up into it. That's a huge impression, probably. Kind of looks pretty thin, though. It doesn't look very wide. But again, it could have stepped on other stuff. <sighs> look at this, just torn down for what? Why is all this? Look at this. See this one? This log, look how much this is, how many this is holding down. And you can't see it fell down and took them. Those are all broken off, ripped off. It might be one of the ones I'm holding. And these are all bent to come under it. Something was doing work in here since we were here last. For sure. saw something down there that was not that was not a deer and that was not a person we're gonna tread lightly cuz I didn't get a good look at it you hear that? it's like something's laughing and then That's a fresh break. That could be from deer. Like, look, see? So we can we can look at this and say, all right, this might have been a deer scratching his antlers. Could have been doing it there too, and that's what pushed it out. Only reason I'd say maybe not is because it actually tucks into all that stuff. So does that one coming down. I'm not gonna spend all day on that stuff, especially when we're having what looks like physical activity. I just want to show it to you so you understand it. We have so many new people rolling in, guys. Excuse me if I regurgitate crap. I'm sorry. But if it's important stuff like this, every single day somebody talks to me about a structure and what it does and why it's there. They're building another teepee. Look. See it? Another teepee there? Look at these huge things. Look. Look at this. They're building another teepee right there. Looks like right in there and right here. Look at this. This is the best one I'll be able to show you. Huge impressions. Huge impressions. That's no joke. Look at that. Sorry, let me back out. That's a heel. Huge heel. I guess it's called like a mid... Tarsal. Mid tarsal. And then... The rest of the foot. Look at this. This is 
exactly where I saw it, but whatever I thought I saw it too, right in here. Sorry, this became my pointing, my pointing stick out of nowhere. Look at that. I wonder if they gave me a piece of the teepee. You know, the new one that they made. I wonder if that's what they were doing. Look at this. This is all part of it. This this branch, this big huge branch right here, going through. Hello, my friends. No disrespect. Huge impression again. Huge impression. <clears throat> Maybe another huge impression right there. I, I mean, I don't, I don't know how much you guys are going to be able to see in this. In this light and that kind of setting, but look at they're building the teepee. Look, see them all going up. There's little ones in there too. That's amazing. This is so impressive. I'm so stoked we came over here. Imagine I almost passed this up. I'm sure you guys can see that. Okay, the video cut off at some point. I might have just trigger happy hit a button. Nothing really happened, so it's been quiet. I thought I heard a person at one point, but I don't know. Alright, let's carry on out of here. All right, I'm gonna try to make it over to the other place, okay? Yeah, look, cause this looks like it's cut too, but it's definitely not. It's definitely not. They just break off clean, I guess. Try and find a trail out of this thorn thicket. Oh, I'll be back. I'm gonna try to get this all in one video, guys. Okay, we're on the outskirts again. I have a gift for them that I forgot to leave. I got all excited. Um, I'm trying to cover some ground here. Bear with me if we're speeding along a bit. Just an update. There's been a lot of this on the trails. Looks like it's because someone's coming and cut it. They all look fairly fresh. Uh, so, I'm assuming there was quite a bit of activity there. Could have been from the heavy rain and the heavy and some of the snow. Um, I wasn't in town every day this week, so I don't know how it affected things. <clears throat> All right. This is one of my little favorite favorite little areas on the way. I never noticed these stone slates here. Might have been a labyrinth at one point, or an attempt to start one. Should start warming up soon. I'm gonna start using the night vision camera. I believe I'm going to 
try and take that kind of stuff, that stuff, and put it into a documentary. No, not like a serious one or seriously long one, I mean. Um, <clears throat> but just kind of have somebody help me uh, make something of it rather than just slap up, slap up raw videos and stuff. Sometimes at night it takes time to like settle in, especially with that camera, figure out what's going on, where you're at. I have a lot of stuff mixed in on the SD card. You know, sky watching. More fresh stuff. Okay, we'll return in a minute. There's another bamboo shaft here. See it? <laughs> it's actually at a trailhead where the one trail goes off that way or goes up that way or goes up towards the bamboo. Look at that, there's another one. I highly, highly doubt. I know it's not people, human people anyway. I know it's not, they're not dragging bamboo all over the place. Especially just to leave it. What's the reason they're doing that, you might ask? I don't know, maybe guiding me? Maybe that's presumptuous, I don't know. But, it seems like everything up to this point has shown that much, but to each their own bamboo. Bamboo. An X, actually. No bamboo. <clears throat> so at this point, somebody would have had to have carried out three or four a large got a glyph hooked on my shoe. Uh, three or four at least large bamboo shoots. Broke them in different various points and then scattered them around. Last time I think we came I think we came up and up and around. So let me kind of double time and find this spot. The darkness is fading fast. I don't know. Update. Tried to take some game trails. As you can see, there's some, some game on it. Just trying to find my way across to the bamboo forest. The trails kind of go around a ways. Oh, hi, friends. You guys let me get close, huh? There's one there. Another one went down the hill a bit. Look at you ducking away from the light. Or are you trying to see me better? Oh, you're smart. I hope nobody's out here messing with you guys like that. Oh, see? Oh, sweet Jesus, there's a dog behind me. <laughs> Look at these guys go. Earlier when I said I heard a person, I definitely did. They are crashing through the woods. Oddly enough, it's like they're making a lot of noise doing it, but it's uh, it's still quiet at the same time. You gotta wonder. Look at this. There's a large, like an old knife here. Maybe it's not old, it's just getting rusted. Look at this here. It looks like there was like almost going to be a trail at some point or something maybe somebody made bike jumps i don't know 
but that's weird. Yeah, there's some pe people walking the dog. I don't know where they came from. There are those farmhouses around the outskirts. It could very well be that these people walked like... Uh, I would do it. If I had trails like this behind my house, I would probably do it right around dusk just to see if anybody was lurking. Every, every place where there's an opportunity like this, there's usually... You'll usually find, uh, you'll usually find, what are they called? Whatever, people who illegally hunt. Oh, there's the buck. Oh, it's a, is he a pie bolt? Is that a pie bolt next to him? No. It's just the back end of a, I can't even tell if she's got, oops, why'd it get all blurry like that? Maybe it's not a buck. Anyway, there's a couple of them right over there. there. One's got its tail to us. Maybe two do. They're all hurtled up. Look at this blue. All right, guys. I gotta find this spot. It should be... That should be it up there. I just gotta find a way to wrap around. I get a lot of vocals. A lot of vocals. I highly doubt. I highly doubt there's a kid playing in this bamboo with with an owl. That's what I'm hearing. Look at this weird shite. I'm sure you guys heard that one. Again, there's a couple of houses on the outskirts. There's one down there and one over there. They're very big houses, so the chances of them having kids in it is probably pretty good. I wouldn't even call them houses. There's a game trail. It's cutting up and in. I can't do it. I could barely make my way through here. You guys can't tell it at the level that we're at, but these uh, thorns are ruthless. That's a huge structure. I never really realized how seriously in depth it was. I don't think we ever came this close to it though. At least from this top side angle. Alright, when I find the entrance, we'll come back. It's a lot of new stuff that sent me around this. You know, I had to come around. It's just too hard. Too many obstacles. Still trying to cut through and it ain't working out. Oh, I'm seeing. Alright. Bamboo out here. The last one. I should have just followed them, right? They literally left me a cookie, uh, like a crumb trail, whatever it's called. Here's another one. Seriously. If I would have just followed the trail verbatim that they left these on, I'm real. Unreal, but yet it happened. Here we are. Here we are, and now we're in the dark, so. Maybe I could kind of show you guys what this, what this looks like. Trying to see if I could get this to what the hell. For some reason when <clears throat> when I zoom in a little, 
it brightens the picture up but I don't know if I want to give full frame and use the flashlight or go in a little and have a have a better picture I was gonna put the camera up on that side and, and then uh, whoa this is wild tell you this place feels a lot different in the dark see how close this thing is to me Is that eye shine for a minute? Look, this is an upside down tree. I don't know if I ever realized it was a whole tree. This is so creepy. Hello, my friends. <clears throat> you hear that? Trying to be, trying to man up here and not rush through this. I think we saw that nest over here, like a bedding area. I think it was on this side one day. Can't remember. Let's go to fresh breaks over here. All pointing inward. This stuff is really hard, <clears throat> really, really hard to break. Especially when it's when it's green and real alive. Hello, my friends. Would you like to talk to us? Can Can you alert us somehow? How about if I turn off the light? If I just use this little one, <clears throat> is that better? This is a trip. So much happening from in there. I keep hearing so much going on. Slide off. I don't even know what that is. We gotta get out of here. <clears throat> uh, this place, I'd imagine, closes at dusk. And it's that spot that has the, uh, the houses right next to the parking lot. So we're gonna have to double time back out of here. are freshly ripped off. That one's been bent in a circle. Like, seriously? Oh, 
I'm not lasted, I guess. As you can see, this bamboo is growing rapidly. It was not out this far. It was not growing all, all the way out here this far. It grows thin, but as thin as it grows, it, it grows thin and then all this Oh. It's a church bell. I don't know where that's coming from. It sounds like it's coming from this direction. But my understanding was that the church was in a totally different direction. You know what? I think I think if I uh, if I leave it at this zoom, we'll get more We'll get more out of it for now, while we have low light. Then if I use the flashlight, so flashlight kind of makes it zoom in. It only like focuses on that white light spot. Comes in handy when you're doing distance, but up close it's just like bow. See, there's a little bit. It's a little bit of, you know, leftover sun poking out but maybe it's moon coming up I don't know but either way when we're in that bamboo it was uh there was nothing to be seen hopefully Brian watches this one uh, Montauk is strange he's, uh, he's been here in person I like to get some other people in here too. Seems like they're pretty uh look bamboo. Right there. Nice piece on the way out too. I guess we're going the right way. I'm so like impressed with that. Look at that. Wait, no mind. We could debunk that, but I can't it's hard to see. Debunked, it's not even bamboo. I'm not gonna look at the ground that hard. I gotta kinda look at what's in front of me too. I have a problem like with the way I walk, I drag my feet a little bit. I don't, I'm not a high stepper. So if there's even something like, like a small root sticking up, I, I hit everything. So I kinda, where I'm going with that is I kinda like, and prepared to trip every step I take. <sighs> All right, I'll be back, guys. Give me a sec. Okay. Yeah, I think we're back on track here. Yes, we are. We're back to the spot, remember? There was like that bamboo X thing. So. We're on a pretty good course to, uh, Should be able to get out of here in about two minutes tops. There's a couple of lights on a house up there somewhere, if you guys are seeing something out in that direction. I don't want anyone chasing the timestamp. I guess it's kind of cool how it doesn't look dark out here on this thing. It's pretty amazing.
I can't see shit out here. I have like a, I have crazy eyesight. Mine's it's better than 2020, whatever 20, 2040 or some crap like that. I forget. I had never heard of it either till till my last eye test. There was like some such amazement. So the night vision camera, um, it's so amazing. It uh, it makes everything look like daytime, even with the lowest amount of light. But if you're in pitch black, pitch dark, it doesn't work. It has to have a little bit of light to work with. Even like moonlight's fine, but it's got to be out. I could have like a 10 lumen flashlight. But anyway, Brother Jimbo topped himself off like he always does. He outdid himself is what I mean to say, which is hard to do, but he got us a psionics, not even like some bootleg ass shit, a psionics to go with the psionics night vision camera. A uh, psionics infrared which we had a problem with the delivery it was something missing and uh, they righted the wrong for us took care of us so I need to give them a special shout out so somebody please hold me accountable for that because I keep I keep forgetting want to do like I'll probably do a live stream and tag them in it I believe I found their channels and I want to the guys that helped us I want to give them a shout out by name because there was a piece that was missing uh, in the delivery that's an important piece it's a slide that mounts mounts the IR flashlight to the night vision camera. Something's yelling. There are houses up here again. Like I said earlier, this house is on the outskirts. Especially going to be some houses coming up in this field that I gotta cross. And that's gonna be where I cut you guys. Cut the camera off at. First of all, my battery's dead. Second of all, I wanna do a special thank you with them off camera for that gift. And all the little stuff they left along the way. If you guys would like to do a little thank you telepathically, right now is your chance because we're about to cut it off. You could comment it, say it out loud, whatever. Whatever you're comfortable with, if you want to. I know. You've probably heard things differently, but I'll let you know. When we do live streams and stuff like that, like Kyle does on Crypto Connection, 
they know. They know there's other people there on the other end of that. I'd imagine the live chat is probably very similar. So as you can see, as we enter this field here, it's not hard to tell that there's some houses nearby. So, we have to be cautious of what we take into consideration. Some of these houses are huge. It'd be a bug out too, like, I don't know. If I saw somebody just like walking out here in this field in the middle of the night. It's not late, granted, it's only like 6 p.m., but. Yeah, a spooky tree. Oh, I can't really see it from here. My, my must need to charge this thing. No, it's just far off. Yeah, I still need to charge it though. It should be lighting that thing up like a Christmas tree. It does go far though, right? It's pretty cool, huh? All right, friends. As always, thank you, thank you, thank you. My trail's coming to an end here. Our video is coming to an end. Our time's coming to an end. I think I said it, but whatever. As always, thank you, thank you, thank you. Have a blessed day. Stay safe. And I will see you on the next one. Peace. I can't put my fingers up in front of the screen right now.